So I just came from work and this was waiting for me. This is Ipsy or BoxyCharm Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. That was what it used to be called before. So let's go ahead and open it up. What is this noise? Okay, good. All right, please stop. After this video, I'm gonna record the unboxing of these. I have three boxes. They're not all full. They're very small items, but it's three separate orders. So I'm gonna be filming that after I'm done with this one. Let me try to do this here. So first item is Beauty Bakery. This is the Lemon Bar Face Palette. It does say it's made in China. Really love their packaging. Look how cute this is here. So it says vegan, calories, gluten, ingredients. What you get, again, I do videos of all these products separately, probably shorts. If I really like the product, I'll do a whole video to talk more about it. This is the highlighter, the bronzer, I guess another bronzer. I really like this one. Looks like it would really be a good match, but we will see says lemon palette does not smell like lemon. I would have loved it to smell like lemon. I love lemon. Usually, like, if it's a flavor, I always pick lemon. From KBD. This is the Tattoo Pencil Liner Longwear Gel Eyeliner. And Trooper Black. There you go. Nice full-size item. Made in Korea. Right, so this is the item. And I was like, oh my god, you gotta sharpen this because I get lazy when it comes to sharpening. But no, look, you twist it. That's so cool. I would have never thought because this is exactly how they come when you have to sharpen them. And the packaging is cute. I love the black. Very sleek, very nice. So I use more liquid eyeliners. I don't know why they haven't sent me liquid eyeliners. You know, that's why you do the survey. Let me know if you get liquid eyeliners in your subscriptions. Longwear cream shadow stick and this is in truffle shimmer. This is what it looks like. This is the color. So I like to put products like this maybe like to highlight the inner corner or like if you do a smoky eye and then to put this like on the inner corner that would be really nice. I mean like this part of the eye here and smoke this part out i think that would look really nice maquillage i definitely think since the merge of ipsy and boxycharm like the brands that we're getting i'm so much more pleased it's brands that i know brands that i always wanted to try so that's a plus are all the products like a hit i don't think so this month i'm like uh, but the brands the brands i'm very happy with the brands we're getting like you're definitely getting your money's worth for what these cost el maquillage this is the color boss squad this is made in italy open it up here and these are the shades this is more something that i would wear it is very plain but it looks very pretty i can't wait to see how it looks in the eyes do the swatches it's an everyday palette. I could see it being very useful. You do get only one matte and it's pretty dark. So I don't know if I would only be able to use this palette for one look. Expect some looks with this. I can't imagine what this costs. Now I can look on the site, but I just haven't. So here we have Ofra. Ofra, Ofra. Like just by looking at here, like you could tell it's Ofra if you're used to the Ofra palettes. So this is the Caribbean Glitz Mini Mix Palette. These are really cool. I have bought another one in the past. Colors, I'm not saying I die for, but I really like that it's like a face and eye palette. So you have a blush, highlighter, a bronzer. You have some colorful shades and then more neutral. So that's pretty cool. Different formulas there too. Like... You have these that are mattes and they have shimmers. I know their highlighters are like everything. Let me know what did you get. Do you like this new BoxyCharm Ipsy? Let me know in the comments. Also going to be receiving Ipsy Glam Bag if you would like to see. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.